a tale of deception and destiny in the lush, verdant lands of England, during a time when the echoes of ancient battles still whispered through the halls of stone castles. An extraordinary tale of deceit and destiny unfolded. This is the story of Alistair, the most unlikely of characters to ascend to the throne. For he was born not of royal blood, but of humble beginnings in a distant village. Alistair was a man of remarkable intelligence and wit, blessed with the gift of mimicry and a keen eye for detail. His life took a fateful turn when he chanced upon a caravan carrying the young Prince Edward, who bore an uncanny resemblance to Alistair. A daring idea sparked in his mind, fueled by tales of royal life and the allure of power. In a daring plot, Alistair managed to switch places with Prince Edward during a chaotic moment when the caravan was ambushed by bandits. The real prince was taken to a secluded cottage in the woods, where he lived a simple life unaware of his true identity, while Alistair, adopting the prince's mannerisms and speech, slipped seamlessly into royal life. As Alistair grew accustomed to his new role, he found himself entangled in the intricate web of court politics. He used his sharp mind to navigate the treacherous waters, winning allies with his charm and vision for a prosperous England. His reforms brought peace and prosperity to the land, and the people, unaware of his true origins, adored their new king. Years passed, and Alistair's rule was marked by a golden age of enlightenment and expansion. However, as time wore on, the weight of his secret bore heavily upon him. He longed for the freedom of his former life, and the guilt of having stolen another's destiny plagued his conscience. In a twist of fate, Alistair's path crossed again with the true prince. Edward, now a man of simple means but of noble heart. The resemblance between them, still striking after all these years, reignited the spark of truth. In a private moment, Alistair confessed his story to Edward, expecting anger and retribution. To his surprise, Edward harbored no bitterness. He had found contentment in his simple life and had no desire for the throne. However, he agreed to keep Alistair's secret under one condition. That Alistair would use his power to better the lives of the common people, ensuring that no one else would suffer from the ambitions of those seeking the throne. Alistair agreed, and with Edward's counsel, he became a king remembered not for the manner of his ascent to the throne, but for the legacy he left behind. A king who, despite his deceitful beginnings, ruled with wisdom and compassion, beloved by his people and respected by his enemies. And so the story of the imposter king became a legend, a tale of ambition, identity, and redemption woven into the rich tapestry of England's history, reminding all that sometimes, those who are least expected to rise to greatness are the ones who lead with the greatest heart.